Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. Today we're going to take a look at Xanadu Bumpers, the Volkswagen Beetle from Cars 3. Now before we get right into the review and the retrospective, let's start with the unboxing. So here we've got her artwork, her diecast sealed inside. The car, the old Cars logo, which is rotated, and the desert background, and the Cotter Pin logo with a teacup saying, and the words Cotter Pin, and the and the words the Cotter Pin, which she's from the Cotter Pin series, the Mattel logo, and the name Xanadu Bumpers. And on the back, we have the old Cars logo rotated, and the Cotter Pin logo, and the, the background of, the, of a screenshot from Cars 3, and the Cotter Pin logo saying, Cotter Pin Bar and Grill, and the description, Friends of the late, great, fabulous Hudson Hornet gather at the Cotter Pin, and the cars, and here we have the cars on the back, which I don't have, are... Jenny Toland, Bill Revs, Vanden Kerr, and Andrew Vrooman. We got 2018 Mattel, the Mattel logo, www.disney.com slash cars, made in Thailand. So now, without any further ado, let's get right into the unboxing. Now, I'll be back as soon as this had been unboxed. Okay, so here we've got Xanadu all opened up and out of the package. So, Xanadu Bumpers is a 1960 Volkswagen Beetle who happens to be one of the inhabitants that live in Thomasville, Georgia, the former hometown of the fabulous Doc Hudson Hornet. During her appearance in Cars 3, she was seen inside the Cotter Pin watching Sweet Tea and her band play music when Smokey entered the Cotter Pin along with Lady McQueen, Cruz Ramirez, Guido, and Luigi. She was also the second Volkswagen Beetle to be released by Mattel in the Disney Pixar Cars diecast line after Cruz B. Soro from Cars 2, who I unfortunately don't have. And during her diecast releases, she was released only one time in a single in 2019. And since then, she has not been released ever since. And now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. So, here we've got her happy facial expression, her maroon exterior paintwork, and the, the gray front bumper, and her circular headlights. And on the hood, we have no tampos, just the Volkswagen emblem on the top of the hood, and her eye, black eyelashes, and her side view mirrors and the chrome silver gray window lining and on both sides we've got the her door and the silver gray line trimming and her chrome silver gray rims on her black wall tires with the red circular borderline red borderline circle lining on them and on the back we've got the red tail lights and the chrome silver gray back bumper and the exhaust pipes and the and the license plate saying 
Let me see. S06 slash 121. We've also got the back window and the engine on the back, engine inside the back, which all Volkswagen Beetles do. And on the undercarriage, it says Mattel Disney slash Pixar made in Thailand. Volkswagen AG, which is copyrighted. And she also bears resemblance to Herbie. And she's also another Cars character to be copyrighted by Volkswagen, along with Fillmore. And now without... And that is it. So now let's pull up some of the other Volkswagen Beetles. We have... Herbie. Pollen. A Carzosi of mine. Jader Bellaton from Cars 2. Rennie. Another Cars OC of mine. And the Easter Buggy, even though the Easter Buggy is a 4x4. Four four. Oh. And also Royce Rebsley. And some of the other Volkswagen models, we've got Fillmore, who is a Type 2 bus. And Gia, who is a 1969 I mean, Carmen Ghia Type 14. And some of the other Thomasville inhabitants, we have Smokey, Junior Moon, although this is simply Hot Rod Junior Moon, and River Scott, although this is simply Hot Rod River Scott. Sweet Tea. And lastly, the fabulous Doc Hudson Hornet. And that is it. Oh. So what do you guys think? Which Volkswagen model is your favorite? Which Thomasville inhabitant is your favorite? And which beetle is your favorite? Is it Xanadu or Herbie? Or simply Herbie? Let me know what you think, as well as leaving suggestions in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!